How is it possible for a 12-year-old boy to feed more than a million children? Well, Jordan van der Waal is doing it. In 2011, he launched a groundbreaking campaign that urged schools to donate food. It quickly gained momentum. In just two years, Jordan's project has managed to achieve the unimaginable. It's time for an important annual event at St. John's Preparatory School. One of the participants, Jordan van der Waalt. He's a 12-year-old kid who hopes for a bright future like many others. I think school's, school's great and I enjoy being at school with my friends and I enjoy doing sports and academics. I want to go study law and play a bit of professional sports. But there's something about Jordan that makes him stand out from the crowd. At his tender age, he possesses the mind of a visionary leader. Over two years ago, Jordan's outlook on life changed drastically after watching a TV documentary. It was a show about what happens to children in South Africa. And they go to school every day and they've got no food, they've got no lunch. They come back home and they still have no food. And I thought to myself, how would I feel if I was them? Deeply moved by what he saw, Jordan was inspired to take action. He approached his principal and challenged him to change the way the school had always done Easter collections. Well, in the past, every year we collect Easter eggs and we give them to <clears throat> children's homes, to, to people that, that need. And Jordan came to me <clears throat> about a month before Easter um, and he said, what about doing something different this year? And so his idea was to, instead of collecting Easter eggs, to collect Mealy Meal. And he decided to call the call the, the campaign Just One Bag. The Just One Bag campaign urged students to bring a bag of Mealy Meal to school to feed starving children in South Africa. Soon SMSs were sent out to the parents at school and flyers were put up and posters were also put up at school. Through word of mouth, Jordan's innovative idea started to inspire others. Donate food, give your old appliances to charity. Soon he had a bigger platform to promote his social initiative. The radio station then challenged all other schools um, to, to collect maize as well. And we had a different drive and on another day, and it was quite phenomenal. By March 2011, Jordan's small scheme snowballed into a massive initiative. With 50 schools, hundreds of volunteers and numerous companies clubbing together, the Just One Bag Drive managed to raise 100 tons of Mealy Meal. In just over two years, Jordan has become a modern-day hero an astonishing 12-year-old kid who managed to put food in over a million tummies. TLC has really been in, in a big bind and we've sent out our appeals and we've had some response but the most practical one we've had is Jordan's contribution. We were so touched, you know, to find a real youngster who just had a vision for somebody and for the greater South Africa, for the humanity that exists here. With several awards in the bag, this ordinary pupil has become a national philanthropist, touring the country and giving motivational speeches. Our children can make a difference. Good morning, teachers and students. Every radio station has wanted Jordan on, and he has spread the word. He's been guest speakers, a speaker at a number of different functions. Um, just recently he went to the graduation for the medical students at the um, University of Free State with Professor Jonathan Janssen and he got a standing ovation. 
not in his teens yet, this young boy has single-handedly helped relieve the cycle of starvation for hundreds of thousands, proving that positive change is possible in South Africa. No matter how big or small you are, your initiative will count. If it's helping people, even if it's helping one, you are helping someone and children can help children. Let's show South Africa what we got. Thanks for watching. Let's do this again next time. My name is Mpola Gaje. Cheers.